Hello beautiful people, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Faithfully Asia and today I'm going to be testing out this straightening brush that I picked up from Amazon. Now this is a non-sponsored video, I did purchase this with my own money and it did run me around $34. And I'm going to be testing it out on Natural 4C here. I've been seeing a couple of videos on this brush and I wanted to test it out for myself because I haven't seen it done on here of this texture. Now I wasn't really sure if I was supposed to blow dry this hair first or use the brush on wet hair because the instructions were not in English. However, I did figure out that you do need to blow dry the hair first and I was trying not to straighten the hair too much by blow drying it as I didn't want to assist with straightening the hair. Now the temperature on this brush is adjustable and it goes from 280 to as high as 400 degrees. So I was really shocked that it was able to get this hair as straight as it did on one pass. I did notice that the way in which this brush straightens the hair is from use of steam. So from my perspective, I do feel like it's less heat damage. I mean, let's be real, heat is heat, but because the way the heat is dispersed from the brush is more like a steam as opposed to direct heat, I did feel like it was a lot more safer than using a flat iron. The actual bristles on the brush are not hot at all. Um, you'll see me here, I'm showing <laughs> my family that it's not hot. She was, she's kind of dramatic, so you know, she was jumping, acting like it was hot, but it's actually not hot at all. She's very tender headed and she is kind of afraid of the flat iron once it gets too close to the root. However, she did comment that it was a lot easier to straighten this hair as opposed to when I use a flat iron. And I will say that this brush did help cut the straightening time in half, so I did find it very helpful. However, I'm going to show you the end results and then I'm going to do a quick comparison between straightening hair with this brush as opposed to straightening it with the flat iron. Now as you can see, her ends did require a trim. She just took them out of braids. However, she did request not to trim it all off in this video and to cut it in stages. So dolls, I'm gonna give you a quick comparison on how this hair would look if I had flat ironed it as opposed to using the straightening brush. And I'm going to give the hair just one pass using my flat iron um, and I do have it at 400 degrees so it is a fair comparison and as you can see the flat iron does get the hair a little bit more straight than the brush however as I mentioned I think that the brush provides less heat damage to your hair so this is perfect especially if you're a natural who are very heat conscious I think it would be a great addition to your wash day and make your life a lot easier and my client does have fine hair so I think this brush was perfect for her because it helps to straighten her hair without making her lose the body that naturally happens when straightening with a flat iron. So dolls, as always, I will include the link to this item in the description box below this video. Be sure and check out last week's wig review. And if you're interested in all things hair and protective styles, be sure and hit that subscribe button on your way out. I'm